Good evening. Major developments in a story we brought you last week. A New Mexico livestock inspector trapped a chihuahua in a leg hold trap that he set in his backyard. Now that man, B.J. Winchester, has been charged with animal cruelty. News 13's Catherine Mazone is live in Valencia County with more. Dean, this brief complaint details the charges against Winchester. Set wildlife leg traps on his property with the intention of trapping domestic dogs. Valencia County Animal Control Director Eric Tanner says it's all about intent. All the instructions and rules for trap setting through the state of New Mexico are for fur bearers. These were not set for fur bearers. These are set for domestic uh, dogs. He says it's not illegal to set leg hold traps on your own property to catch animals like coyotes. It is illegal to set them for pets. The county ordinance is written to where uh, you cannot maim or injure any, an any trespassing animal beyond what is reasonably necessary to keep them off your property. But leg hold traps can break a leg and or deeply cut an animal. I don't see how we can allow that. Tanner says he understands Winchester's frustration, losing livestock to stray dogs, but insists there are other ways to handle it. The setting of a live trap would have been best their large cage traps. A live trap is currently on Winchester's property, replacing the leg hold traps we found last week. Wanda Couch, the owner of the Chihuahua who was trapped last week, says it's a relief. I just hope he realizes that some dogs belong to people and are loved. Couch says she believes Winchester deserves the animal cruelty charges, but says she wishes no ill will against her neighbor. When I got Nika back that day, I thanked him. Winchester could not be reached for comment. <laughs> now, Couch will receive a citation for having her dog out. She says she's currently working to reinforce her fence to ensure it doesn't happen again. Back to you. All right, Catherine, thank you. We spoke to New Mexico Livestock Board Executive Director Ray Baca. He says Winchester has been on administrative leave since Baca got wind of this story last week. He says they have launched an internal investigation and will take these charges into account.